Welcome to ITU Telecom World 2018 here in Durban, South Africa, where I'm very pleased to be joined in the studio today by Henny Ventner, who is the Chief Executive of GEW Technologies. Mr. Ventner, thank you for joining us in the studio. Thank you for having me. Now, I'd like to talk, perhaps we could just start off a little bit by talking about uh, GEW Technologies. What are, you, what are you involved in and, and what brings you here? Yeah, uh, GW for sure, we're in a, a different areas, uh, also defense, but uh, more important for this event, spectrum management and spectrum monitoring, uh, very important to us, uh, and that's the reason for us being here. Now, in terms of uh, smart digital development, which is the, the, the key phrase that's being banded about here, uh, I just wanted to find out what does it mean to you and how is GW working towards it? Uh, smart digital development uh, for sure moves us all into this uh, exciting fourth industrial revolution. Uh, taken into account, telecoms regulators at this point needs to be very innovative in terms of allocating new spectrum uh, to enable them uh, for this uh, technology advance. And in terms of uh, innovation, what single innovation or innovative technology, product, strategy or policy do you think is most transformative? Um, it might be a range uh, or, or on a strategy side where uh, nowadays real-time information of distributed remote sensors, monitoring receivers, processing big data, analytics with that. Also uh, on, on the e licensing spectrum side, very important, and that's a transformative action by regulators to make sure going in, into future uh, to say there's a different way of how to allocate spectrum and reallocate that uh, in real time. And let's talk about spectrum management. Um, what's the role of spectrum management systems in Africa and how is GW uh, contributing and, and, and celebrating uh, its, its half century in the field? Spectrum management, it's a crucial role, especially in developing countries uh, of advancing this uh, digital era. Uh, specifically in Africa, there's a lot of new technologies on the spectrum management side that can uh, uh, influence the outcome and certain African regulators needs to take up this spectrum management uh, innovation like online systems, web portals, uh, e-licensing, uh, online type approvals and that will en enhance uh, the, the African regulators bringing the technology in. What I maybe can add at that point, GW uh, Spectrum Management and Monitoring Solutions is also in use by our own regulatory CASA. Uh, and, and we welcome all African regulators um, to implement solutions uh, designed, developed, engineered, manufactured in Africa for Africa. Talking about African regulators, I'm sure you'll be meeting quite a few here at the event. What's the value of attending events such as ITU Telecom World for you? Uh, uh, the value of uh, attending ITU, GW as a long-standing sta member uh, of the ITU, appreciate these events. Uh, it is not just about uh, getting more information or interacting with uh, industry leaders and our customers or stakeholders, but it's also creating that awareness of the new technology, the era moving into the fourth industrial re revolution. And, and for us being part of that, we enjoy the discussions and the forums on spectrum, spectrum, more spectrum, with uh, keeping in mind the World Radio Conference 2019. Now we've got quite a, a, a diverse audience watching this. I just wanted to find out, is there a message that perhaps you'd like to convey to them? Um, in terms of a GW, a Hensel company, we're also celebrating our 50th uh, year of existence. We're consistently innovating, and this is also an invitation to leaders, policy makers, uh, and the regulators to come and join us tomorrow at 5 p.m. Uh, for an event in terms of c celebrating our success with the ITU. <laughs> Look forward to it. Any event, thank you very much indeed. Thank you very much. Great stuff. <laughs>